Peter, not your average guy, on the Never Mind Your Own YouTube channel with the Mavic Air on Cyprus. It's a beautiful day, the sun is shining. I did a test already, a range test. Now what I want to do is I want to test the sports mode. But I also want to see if I can get my fetch our goggles working with this thing. Battery. Whatever. And uh, for that I use the Nvidia shield like this. Okay guys, just one thing. What I'm doing, it's no problem at all. It's just wilderness out there. You know, so if something happened with the drone, then I have to walk and retrieve it, but nobody will get hurt. No property is going to be damaged and everything. So let's start the motor. Like that. Just to get out of here. And um, I have to say that this is a little bit, it's not as smooth as the Phantom when I do this. It's just something I noticed. So you have to be very, really careful. It's always difficult to pen like that. Okay, we're going in sports mode. And we want to see how that footage is going to be. Oh, the camera is... What is it doing? I go in sports mode and the camera goes down. Why would you want to do that? The camera cannot even go higher than that. Now it can a little bit. It's adjusting the camera by itself. And then when I stop, now I can put the camera up again. Wow, what a strange feature. I think because it does not want the propellers in view. Now I've seen, I've seen a feature that has to do with the gimbal, advanced settings, extend gimbal tilt limit. So I'm gonna put that on. Now I go forward, now it goes down again nah and I can put the camera up like this you see that <laughs> but but even when I do that and I go forward automatically the camera goes down oh strange That is just strange. And and now the camera is shocking a little bit, you see. I'm just going forward. So let's turn around this tree like this. That's let's stay away from the houses. Stay away from the houses. There's a tree. I'm gonna do like this. And now you saw that the, that the camera is, is moved, but it's, it's in sport. I'm losing signal a little bit, I think.
you see when I when I fly sideways like this then the camera turns weak signal well I think like this it's more more like a racing drone it's pretty it's pretty there but I don't like that the camera is going down why you want to do that <laughs> I think when it's flying sideways it's just more than the the camera can handle. I'm moving. Well, it's it's okay. I don't I don't have the hook audio to hear anything. It's just to. signal sure um, I see I say cancel return to home. Oh, well. This is where home is. Yeah. And now this this hook audio is beeping in my ear. That's all of this. <laughs> this hook audio is beeping in my ear. That's one thing. I think the battery is low. So it means after three sessions, the battery is down. And that's a dis disadvantage of this because it means I will have to charge this thing every time. What I like about this is is that um, the audio is at a really good level, like a high level, uh, better than any of the other microphones I have ever used. So I always have to pump up the audio with other microphones. This one is good right out of the box. I, I, I just don't know what I have to think of this when I have the Phantom 4 Pro 
I don't have to be in sports mode. I can just be in GPS mode. It's flying smooth. It's flying quick. And I can just <coughs> go everywhere. And and the video is like like almost perfect. With this in in normal mode it's not that quick so you go in sports mode it's a little bit like a racing drone like then uh, but the camera is all the time I dislike that the camera is going down that much because it means you cannot just see where you're going not good enough I want it to be higher but for some reason I can't get it like that. This works, I mean, I can just have my Nvidia Shield, I can have this, that works pretty all right. So you can have your own goggles. Well, and for the rest, you've seen the video, you see the footage, you can draw your own conclusions. Leave any comments, any suggestions, like the video, subscribe to the channel if you want to see the next videos that are upcoming oh wait a minute my audio i don't know if you can hear me very well right now because now i'm recording with this one anyway see you on the next video oh yeah and one more thing the battery of the controller of the mavic air is also it's, it's 50 percent like now and that's two flights the controller of the Phantom 4 Pro lasts a lot longer.